Good evening, everyone. I welcome you all. The session will start in a few minutes. Yes. Good evening, ma'am. How are you? I guess there is a little technical issue from your end. Uh, the range is going, and your video is not clear. My video is not clear. No, no. Still, it is not clear. Not clear. My Wi-Fi is on. I guess you have to shift your position, ma'am. Actually, I'm on Wi-Fi. Yeah, I'm on Wi-Fi. I don't know, but your picture is not at all clear. Mm -hmm. Still the same? No, no, still the same. No. Total blur. Oh. yeah perfectly fine yes yes uh good evening everyone i'm dr aditi kulkarni i'm a consultant physiotherapist ergonomist and i'm the director of b active physiotherapy and ergonomics clinic uh actually this session was supposed to happen at 2:30 it happened as a live but because of the technical hitch we couldn't upload that's why i really appreciate all the effort dr prabha is taking and giving us a live session today again one more time in a day Thank you so much, Dr. Prabha, for being uh, such a supportive and a spontaneous. Uh, uh, of course, as always, you are like that. But definitely, it's a great uh, uh, this thing. Uh, I'm really happy that you said yes to give me this session again. Thank you so much, and I welcome you, Dr. Prabha. Is a homeopath consultant. She is in this field since almost around uh, 15 years. and uh, she is also a uh, expertise in the micronutrients which are uh, definitely required as a health supplementation point of view for the entire well being of your body and so we are uh, going to discuss in today's session how uh, the health supplements are applicable for you how it is going to be helpful in your daily routine and uh, what is the age group uh, that we are going to uh, decide and how we are going to decide the dosages of the uh, the health supplementations which are actually required and then there will be the hormonal effect uh, how if you start uh, taking the uh, taking your all the dosages in the health supplementation point of view so the brief about health supplementations and the overall aspect of that particular thing and how to implement it in your entire daily routine that we are going to see in today's session thank you so much ma'am without wasting a much time now i'm handing over this session to you thank you so much thank you thank you so much aditi for having me for this session Uh, thank you it's my honor rather <laughs> you said yes <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and uh, all the i mean the way you have lined up the talks is very amazing there is a flow to it and also thank you. Hearty, hearty congratulations for completing 7 years and wish you many more years of success in future thank you so much ma'am yes so yes aditi we can start the session Yes, so uh, actually, ma'am. Uh, now, the, as a health uh, nutrients and a health supplementation, there are uh, two aspects of it. Like there is a healthy food which you can go to the dietitian or the nutritionist, and they are going to prescribe it to you. 
and there is a one aspect that you can implement actually the health supplementations into your entire daily routine so uh, if, uh, now what exactly the health nutrients are all about and what are the uh, things comes under that and why those are beneficial for your body yes uh, aditi in your previous session I mean, uh, you we would like to know more in detail about it yes definitely uh aditi in your previous sessions you have uh, you no know, introduced uh, emotional health medical you no know, mental health and uh, yes. physical health eating right kind of food and uh, also having a positive attitude so Very actually true. if you see yes if you see all these three things are interrelated like if you are physically right. healthy you you feel good your mental health is good you have a good attitude towards uh, life even when you are high on energy your energy levels are correct then you can enjoy everything in life so uh, these are very interdependent things fir uh, along with food along with hmm. food why do we need supplementation is the question and uh, first of all i would like to tell ki like people have a great thing uh, great uh, confusion ki they think supplements are medication which is not so uh, medication not true at all treat, yes so medication is to treat illnesses whereas supplementation is to prevent illnesses so these are two Correct. opposite things and supplementation is like you are adding things to your food which you are right. not getting from the diet so that is Correct. supplementation so uh, yes uh, uh, it's uh, like for good health like good sleep is important your energy levels have to be good what you eat you have to be very mindful about what you're putting in your mouth uh like i said uh like our body is an organization and Correct. there are millions and trillions of cells in it and they work together so for them to work together in harmony and create a balance in your body uh these uh the cellular nutrition comes into place where you have to be mindful about what you're eating and what all you need to i mean why you are eating i mean if you are eating certain kind of food very true very true contain, and what is how is it going to benefit your body so this become right. this is one important aspect and Correct. also uh, like nowadays what happens is the eating habits have changed we eat outside a lot uh, kids eat, have got like so much of packaged food and these food have preservatives they have addictives they love the taste of the junk food and they want to eat more and more like every time you take your child out he wants to buy some junk food and eat it and if you don't give them then there is a big show they'll be cranky so, like anything <laughs> yes yes so uh, another thing why they are cranky is another hmm. that there are some nutrients which are deficient in the body that is causing that irritability that is causing that craving for wrong type of food. so uh, this is one thing like now students are there living in hostels they are living in out other countries uh, they have to figure out cooking so they don't know how to uh, know uh, the right way of cooking and what all should go in at a time like what, what a meal should consist of and again working women yes working women and men who are single they are like on their own they are ordering food from outside or they are having some uh somebody send a dabba so all these things come into factor and these uh thing certain things we cannot change we can't help so right. in this condition supplement supplementation becomes very important so that you don't miss out on those essential nutrients and uh, the, uh, yes and also um supplementation i mean uh, if you do uh, if there is a deficiency then only people think about having a multivitamin having a b12 deficiency so they'll think about a b12 supplement or a, a calcium supplement if there is osteoporosis like if you have a deficiency today it is because last 4 5 6 7 8 years you have been deficient like little little things pile up and it becomes big so you have not been uh, getting a particular nutrient for past few years that's why you are deficient today and uh, also our body is very forgiving 
the best part is the body is very forgiving aap kitna abuse karte ho body ko you put in so much of junk food you put so much of unwanted food so much amounts of food you are addicted to sugar you are addicted to many other things so uh, unknowingly we are eating eating and everything piles up in the body and then uh, obesity is like uh, our next best friend or bad friend i don't know but every other person is obese is fat so these health issues are arising and also uh, less physical activity because we are sitting working from home we are sitting in front of the uh, gadgets so the like sedentary lifestyle like these yes. days so there is a lot of sitting whereas our body is meant to move so you are supposed to move Correct. a lot and then also there are some myths like abhi diabetic hai to theek hai main aaj laddu kha lunga aur kal subah aadha ghanta zyada walk kar lenga kar lunga ha right yeah or uh, <laughs> no i eat one some people even take a medicine extra when they are no they eat yeah yeah they try to manage it so somehow that situation they want to handle yes so yes. actually it doesn't work either ways no popping a pill doesn't help or even i'm walking tomorrow 15 minutes will not remove the sugar that has accumulated it gets converted into fat cells and it is stored so uh, these are uh, yeah so there is a lot of a uh, lack of awareness when it comes to nutrition or micronutrition which is my favorite topic so like uh, right. we all know macronutrition micronutrition in macronutrition we have uh, carbohydrates protein and fats to humko pata hai roti khaya to this is carbohydrate uh, no chicken kha liya to this is protein or eggs kha liya to then uh, fats also we know like ghee butter cheese these are all fats and uh, some people think eating cheese se mote ho jayenge nahi those are good fats so dairy se jo fat aata hai those are good fats which are needed so there is a portion or proportion required per day by the body if you give mm-hmm. food or nutrition in that particular uh, portion then your body i mean you will be lean you will be healthy your energy will be very high so Uh, right. for example like everyone knows uh, that 1 gram of protein is required per kg body weight every day but when you go Correct. to calculate so if you are a vegetarian then so you're definitely deficient in protein every day so ye pile up ka hoga jab aapka 10 kg 20 kg wazan badh jata hai so that's how it works right. again um, like fats like good fats, people are restrict themselves nahi zyada ghee nahi zyada butter nahi ज्यादा चीज नहीं नहीं ये सब ज्यादा खाना चाहिए आई मीन देर इज देर इज ऑल्सो अ पोर्शन लाइक आपको थर्टी टू फोर्टी ग्राम गुड फैट्स चाहिए एवरी डे अगेन कार्बोहाइड्रेट यू हैव टू रेस्ट्रिक्ट कार्बोहाइड्रेट यू शुड नो टू मेजर कार्बोहाइड्रेट्स लाइक इंडियन डाइट में ब्रेकफास्ट उपमा पोहा एनी थिंग इडली नेम इट एंड एवरी थिंग इज कार्बोहाइड्रेट अगेन लंच में भी रोटी राइस like i will i eat only three chapatis no your body needs only one why you are giving it three so that has to be up somewhere correct yeah so we are forcing our body to work in a particular way so if we correct our habits correct our diet uh, the body bounces back very well so that is one thing that we can control is you can control your habits and control your body so you can get things back into shape back into your hands and uh, no experience experience optimal health and there is no uh, particular type abhi to main 50 ki ho gayi ab nahi ho sakta nahi aisa kuch nahi hota it's all like age is a number we definitely uh, i completely agree with this point the age is the number and uh, at any age anybody can start a proper supplementation in your life and at the same point of time uh supplementation is like a just about your food and the daily requirements are going to get fulfilled just based on your uh, uh, whenever you are going to have your proper food automatically uh, uh, everything is going to get maintained but if you are developing a deficiencies definitely there must be something lacking in your diet and there must be something lacking in your nutritional part that is the reason the role of a supplementation comes into play and instead of going for directly uh, the medicines point of view we always suggest that the daily dose of supplementations will always help you to maintain your overall well being there are many uh, questions comes ma'am uh, uh, the today's session for today's session 
कि आर वी वी आर नॉट डेफिशियंट इन एनीथिंग स्टिल डू वी नीड सप्लीमेंटेशन फॉर आवर बॉडी सो वॉट इज युअर ओपिनियन ऑन दैट uh ma'am there was a question uh, uh ki yeah. when uh, yes uh, the question is ki uh, if we don't have any deficiencies in our blood there are uh, all the reports are optimal definitely and we are working also properly the workout is going on we are not sedentary we are trying to maintain all the possible ways to maintain the good nutrition still the one person can need a nutritional supplements in their daily routine or only the person who has a deficiency has to have those supplementations yeah i can hear you now okay So yes, uh, people think yes. Uh, yeah, there is a wrong notion that you need supplements only when you have deficiencies, and they follow the blood reports. If you see the blood reports, they are parameters for illness and not for wellness. So supplementation is for wellness. Okay. Medication is for illness. So uh, the parameters like my cholesterol. Here for functioning properly, and when efficiency doesn't mean I mean. Correct. Important role in your body every day. So. क्वांटिटी जाना चाहिए द रेकमेंडेड डेली अलाउंस जो है वो जाना ही चाहिए लाइक फॉर एग्जांपल वी टेक कैल्शियम कैल्शियम लाइक ग्रोइंग फास्टर दे हाइट ग्रो मैम आई गेस देयर इज अ नेटवर्क इशू आई एम नॉट एबल टू हियर यू प्रॉपर्ली uh it's coming in the uh, very uh, this thing uh, the cra- uh, the cracks out is coming the voice is not clear at all and i am not able to hear you also i am not able to see you also ma'am if the wifi uh, is just a suggestion i mean it's a live talk so uh, there has to be the network issue which we have to sort out Uh, you know, if the, there is any place where uh, the range is coming i mean uh, because now there is no voice and there is no even face which we are able to see all right okay i'll check where i can go ha huh, because uh, it's not at all clear that's why extremely sorry audience uh, there is a little technical issue please bear with us yes thank you so much ma'am now it's pretty clear yes, and i uh, guess we'll be able to hear you properly <laughs> yes i'm actually today there is a lot of network issue going on yes, that's the reason i guess in the afternoon also we faced also, a lot of issues yeah so don't correct, mind i'm correct. standing in the balcony now but uh, this is the best place to be uh, so very true so yeah, yeah. So yes, Aditi, you were asking me a question. Ah uh, yes, the question was that uh, the health supplementations are always required for the pay- a person, as in to maintain the well-being, or is it ah uh, something like you have to have a deficiency to take the any health supplementation, like the oh, medicines, see, like I am a deficient a... with my calcium or I am a deficient with my iron. So is actually yeah. required to go ah uh, for that kind of a situation only, or on a daily basis also I can take it. 
नहीं ऑन डेली बेसिस ऑल्सो यू कैन टेक इट सेफली बिकॉज दैट इज वाई वी आर ईटिंग फूड एवरी डे राइट टू गेट दीज न्यूट्रिय फ्रॉम फूड जस्ट बिकॉज द फूड द बायो अवेलेबिलिटी इन द फूड हैज रिड्यूस दैट इज वाई सप्लीमेंटेशन हैज बिकम अ मस्ट नाउ नो इन टूडे लाइक या वी आर नॉट गेटिंग ऑर्गेनिक फ्रूट्स एंड वेजिटेबल्स we are not i mean we are eating more processed foods so everything is packaged and frozen and no well, free yeah free the more of junk food everything food. like that right? yeah so that is the reason where the nutritional value of the food has reduced so that is why we okay. need additional yeah that is why we need supplementation and uh, when uh, see for example like you asked or you spoke about calcium so we need around right. 1000 to 1200 mg of calcium every day and one glass right. of milk contains 125 mg of calcium so if you right. uh, see yeah if you check a few sources of calcium from food so have you eaten that food every day can you eat it every day can you have 8 to 10 glasses of milk and what about right. the milk uh, what about the quality of the milk that we are getting that is another question uh, is that food uh, containing a sufficient amount of uh, calcium the milk right. is so adulterated so we are getting so much adulterated food that is why so supplementation becomes important in today's time so if you see uh, a newborn baby who's day one no the mother's milk is the best actually but still Correct. we give them a multivitamin drop we give them a calcium drop why because that is needed for their growth even a heartbeat needs calcium the calcium if you don't supplement calcium the heartbeat heart is going to beat every day so right. it will start taking calcium from your bones if you are not giving it through food it will take it from your bones and then after few years five years 10 years you will have osteoporosis so right so that the, means uh, uh, yes the basic concept of taking health supplementations is never wait for the deficiency have to have the at least the supplementations in your daily diet routine yes. make uh, it is like a habit for yourself so automatically the most of the diseases you can keep it away from your body uh, the book right. which i always uh, me and dr prabha used to discuss in our clinic this is the best book which you can give it to your patients as well as the viewers uh, yes. uh, the one dr has always discussed it's a very nice book if anybody yeah. would like to have a free copies can buy uh, not buy you can take it from us definitely yes. we are uh, very happy to give it to you uh, yes. the book name is uh, that uh, your you, doctor oh. what you yes, not, yes, not, not know might be killing you yes what right you right not know about nutrition might be killing you right And... yes yes so uh, those are the parts which i uh, really liked about that uh, particular part is like if, uh, yes definitely there are many conditions which are associated with the deficiency in the early stage of your life which we keep yes. ignoring like simply the dementia uh, there are uh, many uh, sclerotic changes there are arthritic changes there are osteoporotic changes and which we directly jump and conclude ki ha this is the diagnosis so why this actually happened yes. the root cause is basically in your entire life what you have done with your body so right. uh, that you can definitely prevent and uh, you can definitely uh, manage it with the taking a good supplementation uh, there is a one more point which i would like to uh, ask uh, on behalf of the viewers ma'am ki uh, when the person is into the supplementation lot many things he will be able to cope up with but uh, it is acting like a immune system everything is fine but is it related to the allergic condition or the non communicable diseases or anything is going to get help with this kind of a supplementation yes a uh, very nice question aditi uh, this did not come in the afternoon but uh, i would love to answer that uh, yes a lot of allergies are also related to some uh, no um, antioxidants which are deficient in your body some nutrition uh, you know uh, micronutrients which are deficient in your body and if you see the color of fruits and vegetables god has given so many colors because every color has a function and these colors can actually help you with your um, allergies yeah 
correct so that's why yeah okay and, okay uh, that's, that's why, why our uh, yes yeah, that's why the natural therapist also in the first session mentioned about the color therapy which you can learn and can get uh, yourself treated so the same thing ma'am dr prabha is also insisting on ki there has to be the colors like we insist on the salad it's a multiple mm-hmm. color the red green lots of uh, the variety we are going to eat red, so automatically yellow, the purple. nourishment is going to be provided yeah yeah the yellow purple everything so uh, including your fruits uh, so there are mm-hmm. multiple colors which are going to provide it to you the same thing uh, dr prabha is insisting on that the supplementations are also going to bring lot of colors in your life and definitely it is going to heal you from the root Yes. yes. So then supplementation is your insurance for good health. Like Correct. you have insurance policy. It's a long term insurance, insurance policy. <laughs> yes. Definitely. Yeah. And I uh, also wanted to know ki, uh, if there is a visceral fat kind of a thing nowadays coming uh, in uh, in the picture. Ki, like there are people are getting deposited a lot of fat. The people are getting obese. There are a lot of cancer cases are coming. The, sometimes it's a prostate cancer. The breast engorgement. There are a lot of hormonal changes people are facing. the cases yeah. of pcods are increasing definitely there is a treatment available patients can undergo treatment they can uh, uh, get treated themselves but at the end yes. of the story how to prevent it is it actually possible by taking the good supplementations in the daily routine yes uh, aditi amazing question uh, all these i mean if you see we are putting a lot of chemicals in our body like right? there is food pollution right. there is water pollution air pollution so that is Correct. why cancer is on rise so these uh, chemicals which are entering in our body these pollutants which are entering in our body they need these micronutrients in appropriate levels no antioxidants in appropriate levels so that they can detox your body so okay. actually great yeah Yes, you can actually detox your body from air pollution, water pollution, food pollution, and definitely antioxidants will help you uh, prevent cancers. And okay. I'm working with. And uh, yeah. Yes, and what about the visceral so fat? I, I mean, with, is it actually possible? Yes, it is actually possible. So that is the importance Great. of these micronutrients and antioxidants. And also, I am working right now with a lot of uh, cancer patients who have already got cancer, and they are on chemo's and everything. So their requirement is even higher. The nutrition required, the antioxidant levels required by them is the most because there are there is so much of side effect of chemo, radiation therapy. So to remove these toxins, again, like medication is also another type of toxin. No, medication can be side effects. So those side effects are not right, right. only. your requirement is more like growing children i said their nutritional value is much more than us like i might need 1000 mg of calcium but a growing child will need 1300 1400 so uh, there are different stages of life where you need more athletes sports people you know Correct. very well their requirement is much higher they are also pregnant right. lady yeah and then after Even the, your uh, age right the uh, pre menopausal uh, then the perimenopausal, perimenopausal the post menopausal uh, there are n number of stages of the woman's life as well as even in the boys and uh, uh, adult of men we can say we keep ignoring yeah. the adult health of the men because they don't even bother about it ki they are also going to end uh, soon going to enjoy their menopause because menopause <laughs> is actually what applicable to the woman but yes the hormonal imbalances hormonal changes are also they are also facing so yes, also they even... need a supplementations for those because most of the uh, talks we have come across is all about women women health uh, women needs hormonal imbalance women everything yes we have noticed even the boys need it even the men need it and they also have to take a supplementation never yeah. ignore your health yeah. yes like uh, uh, we always relate no we know only one function jaise for example calcium is required for bone health itna hi logon ko pata hai nahi lekin aapke heart ko muscles ko even uh, the reproductive hormones what we are talking about Correct. ki men reproductive hormones and like testosterone estrogen and uh progesterone correct the progesterone so yeah, today the testosterone no. yes yes definitely yes. and you need a micronutrients the proper electrolyte balance the atp has to, to be there balance this uh, reproductive hormones. yes the basic yes. is calcium and then the uh, the potassium sodium influx and everything is going to get balance all the hormones yes so correct. uh these uh, nutrition is i mean the bodies are same 
except the functions uh, a few functions are different but definitely the definitely the supplementation and the micronutrition required is the same for men women old age right. child anybody yes uh, so uh, according to you the way you mentioned ki the person who is suffering from the diseases the person is not at ease definitely they need yes. a proper supplementation than the yes. healthy person yes uh, a person who is sick needs much more again the nutrition requirement is higher they need right. to supplement if you are having any medication if you give supplements to your body your body will react to the medicines well and recover faster so a supplementation okay. becomes even more important when you are ill and uh, we have seen many cases where just by supplementation you did not take medication for the regular na uh, aches and pains or the flus or na uh, some gastric trouble you can simply add a couple of supplements and your body uh, recovers on its own so supplements boost your defense mechanism so your body right. is capable of fighting everything if you give the right nutrition right in the uh, physiotherapy department there are many people come for the core strengthening there are many uh, people who are facing the ibs issues like irritable bowel syndrome or there are some gastritis or any kind of a thing so i agree yeah. with this ki they have to have the proper green leafy vegetables in their diet to maintain the correct uh, fibers content in their body but is it actually the supplementation can provide these kind of a things to them to overcome those issues absolutely absolutely there are supplements for improving your digestion your assimilation there are uh, there is fiber which is a most important supplement for your gut health everything like your uh, everything absorption and excretion everything occurs through the intestines so you have to have a very good gut health again fiber okay. is a probiotic probiotic which will help you increase your uh, gut bacteria millions of healthy bacteria will increase so uh, it's very healthy like your whole system like i have seen ibs cases ulcerative colitis and some gastritis patient simply recovering by supplements without any medication because again medication Great. and what about uh, the people <laughs> yes no no uh, i just wanted to know ki yes definitely you mentioned about the ibs gastritis and everything but the people who have the sphincter issue they get a lot of barb so uh, which is related to the sphincter issue along with the digestion issue so uh, i always suggest ki that time it is necessary to have the good supplementations because you are already into the going to be in the nutritional deficiencies but are they able to digest those supplementations yes very good question uh, what supplement and you are taking is a very very important thing like always uh, i say read the labels no there are many supplements available in the market but your job right. is to yeah even food everywhere you know there is a label so that label if you understand and try to read those labels a lot many things you can correct yourself like uh, for example uh, i always suggest ki go for an organic source of supplement because if you give a chemical source the body is confused no to how to react but when you give us an organic supplement it it accepts it as food so it knows how to react how to adjust how to absorb so it is very right. important to always and always i recommend people do so because, not buy because uh, uh, yes there are lot many brands that are available in the market yes uh, the one are with the uh, completely a chemical base which is totally dependent from the pharmaceutical industries sometimes surely they are needed but if you want yes. to go on a long term and the health supplementations has to be with the natural supplementation then there are uh, yes. a neutral uh, the neutral the sub yes the neutral chemicals and nutritional industries are there so uh, those yes. uh, things are marked over there and you can go for yes. those kind of an uh, uh, supplementation and that will be easily digestible if you are taking 8 to 9 also because yes. if the person is so much deficient or sometimes they are suffering from certain diseases so i have came across ki they need a glucosamine they need a omega 3 they need a uh, sometimes it's a multivitamin multimineral sometimes it's a iron sometimes you have to include even the calmac d uh, i mean calcium has to be go given with the magnesium and vitamin d3 so uh, those many things i definitely advise them to take it together yes. so uh, at yeah. that time those many questions arises always ki am i able to digest those so uh, mm-hmm. that digestion part definitely ma'am has already cleared you will be able to digest because those are health supplement 
and those are the natural substance product and so that your body is definitely going to absorb those definitely there is a time the experts like us are going to there to guide you what time you should take and what is the amount you should consume but uh, i mean ma'am is there i am there we, uh, we all are as a team will be able to help you ki how much quantity what are the products are good one uh, and how you have to take it what can be the medium is it prior breakfast and after breakfast but yes if the digestion part you are concerned about you will be able to digest about it digest yes. it for sure yes uh, then i will be uh, leading to the another question of the day ki if yes. the age group is uh, totally inactive like uh, yeah. the people who below 18 uh, the zygapophyseal growth of the bone is still uh, going on and after yeah. the adult group and in the aged group so uh, the nutritional supply, uh, supplement requirement changes from uh, the, the daily pattern or is it re- going to remain same no no it changes like with age uh, with your health conditions your requirement is definitely different each individual mm-hmm. so we usually do an individual assessment and then looking at their body composition you, if a person is obese Oh, there's a lot of inflammation. You can make it out from the face. You know, the face is inflamed. Right. Like if you're, yeah. And uh, some people they say, oh, because of my hormones, I'm not able to lose weight. Or because of some other reason, I'm not able to do it. And people right. follow hundred hundred type of diet. Definitely by any diet, up diet, पे जाओ भी पंद्रह दिन में दो तीन किलो तो उतरना ही है by any diet you follow. But right. there has to be yes. But I always say that follow a scientific diet which has a balance of micronutrients and macronutrients. Once you give right. micronutrients and micro nutrients in the proper proportion, the body right. becomes a fat burning machine, and you will start losing weight at any age. Like my uh, oldest uh, weight loss clients are two: my mother, seventy five, and one uh, cancer patient, eighty two. Her doctor had asked her to lose weight. and she lost around 13 kg with me without any side effects her energy levels went up wow so congratulations ma'am on, yeah, awesome because on the wheelchair she started moving around so great uh, it is very important to create this balance of macro and micro nutrition so right So yeah you, because uh, you your mother uh, is the right person to yeah. give this kind of a feedback to us because uh, yeah. i treated with the physiotherapy and you treated with the health supplementations and we got a wonderful results with the frozen shoulder and a cervical pain it's and uh, in a very gone. few sessions uh, yeah and it was yeah. a complete overall uh, well being now she is maintaining and that's why she is so happy at this age also yes. that to uh, yes. i have only come across in certain cases you can definitely deal with the combination therapy with the fitness as well as with the supplementation and uh, that is the reason this exercise medicine as a, a new uh, branch i have launched in my clinic and i really need a help of you uh, i mean the experts like you in my clinic when the patients are uh, facing this kind of a lack of energy the lack of supplement uh, lack of uh, deficiencies in something so uh, definitely these supplements are going to be in a daily routine for them the micronutrients and the macronutrients you have to balance it in a proper manner uh, definitely under the guidance of the experts because if you are going to choose it on your own it is going to be very difficult for you ki uh, how much to take and what to take and what not to take yes. so there are experts yes. like us who will be able to guide you but choose it wisely because every uh, chemical is going to give you a side effects on your body or otherwise uh, sometimes it's an effect on your body we can say definitely good and the bad everything has in an excess is going to damage your body Yeah. so the same is uh, applicable even with the health supplementations they are organic or not that really doesn't matter excess yeah. is going to damage so what quantity is required how much is required based on the consultation we are going to decide about it uh, so this is how uh, exactly what i felt from this today's session yeah it's a wonderful informative session ma'am uh, we are very uh, happy to have you for this session now it's the audience your time if any questions are arising in your mind please uh, write down in the comment box we are very happy to uh, answer all those questions Uh, thank you so much, ma'am, for wonderful information sharing with us about the health supplementations and its implementations in the daily routine for maintaining well-being. Thank you so much. Audience, any question? Thank you ma'am it's a pleasure
and really uh, uh, it was a wonderful informative session and we enjoyed a lot and thank you so much for your giving your valuable time twice for us uh, the afternoon viewers and the evening viewers uh, today uh, yes uh, we made it at least finally in the evening because there is a lot of technical and uh, range issue is going on i don't know somehow <laughs> yes but thank you so much uh, for giving your valuable time twice in a day <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for having me Aditi and I wish you all the best for your clinic. Thank you so much ma'am. Your blessings means a lot to me because I uh, the way uh, I was there and the way I am getting the support from you all is the main thing which I was already uh, I always wished in my life. He uh, if the people around me are so uh, giving me blessings and they are helping me so much in my endeavor definitely I'll be succeeding in my life for sure. <laughs> definitely yeah. and all the viewers tomorrow 2:30 there will be the live session with dr uh, chodia he is going he is a, a very renowned homeopathic consultant we are uh, going to connect sharp at 2:30 2:30 to 3:30 will be the session you will be able to ask all the questions which you have in your mind and the doubts which are related uh, to the homeopathy uh, so uh, see you all tomorrow at 2:30 thank you so much ma'am good night yes, thank you thank you aditi bye Thank you bye bye viewers thank you so much for being a wonderful audience and being so patient and bearing with us <laughs> thank you so much <laughs>